With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, a meter stick is pivoted about its center, a piece of wax of mass 20 gram traveling horizontally and perpendicular to it at 5 meter per second strikes and adheres to one end of the stick so that the stick starts to rotate in a horizontal circle given the moment of inertia of the stick and wax about the pivot is 0.02 kg meter square initial angular velocity of the stick is so we can say here suppose this is our let's say here stick this is our meter stick pivoted about its center now here a piece of wax so this is suppose a piece of wax here of mass given here as 20 gram so this mass here is given to be 20 gram it is traveling at speed 5 meter per second it here hits this end one end and sticks to it such that this rod rotates in a horizontal circle so we can say here this let's say here stick let's say gets stuck with an this is our wax now this whole system about the center rotates with let's say here omega initial angular velocity which we have to find out now since no external torque is acting on the system hence we can apply angular momentum conservation about the hinge point here so we can say here initial angular momentum of the system equal to final angular momentum of the system since it is a meter stick so we can say here the distance here will be 0.5 meter from one end to the center so this translatory particle will have an angular momentum of mvr that is we can say here as 20 by 1000 into velocity here is 5 meter per second and distance here is 0.5 and since initially this rod was at rest, so initial angular momentum of this rod is zero. Final angular momentum of the whole system will be I omega. And here it says moment of inertia of stick and wax about pivot that is hinge point is 0 0.02. So this is 0 0.02 into omega which we need to find out. So this here comes out to be let's say 100 so 0 0.05 divided by in the denominator there is 0 0.02 is equal to omega so angular velocity omega comes out to be 2.5 we can say here radian per second that is option number 3 is the correct answer hence we can say 3 is our answer for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today